let's see the another features of release 3.0 which we are introducing tax rate setup even today in the product we have the option to define the tax rate at a multiple level so let's see how will be implemented to start with the define the product tax rate at the one level but defined the hsn code at another level was not possible so let's take a look as a scenario assuming are you dealing with a multiple stock item with a different hsn code but all the item for under the same tax rate so you will not define anything in the hsn and just give the rate details in the gst rate details we are giving a choice to the user to select the order of sources which system he should be follows also it can be changed a multiple time within effective date so that earlier transactions are not affected so now if we create any master for example stock item if we see the hsn is not defined it can be specified here itself where has the gst rate has been taken has a specified in the company save the all the details now where we go to the transaction and select the same stock item we can see that the sources of gst rate is a company where the sources of hsn is a item master which you can see here is that the product clearly shows the sources from which the detail can be a ping now assuming that only for this transaction the user want to override the adjacent details same can be changed uh, easily in the similar manner of sse rate can be overridden it will be a v required second features is expensive and stationary where each stationary can be have different tax rate or hsn code if need to be book in a single ledger user can just do that now they can also define the items which they generally deal with so that override it must be a easier user can easily define and overridden a gst rate and adjacent to a stationary and expenses wise isn't it easy thank you for watching